Well, the South Africa Racing Nurseries next end five furlongs, not to eighty. Top one is Briquette, Martin Needham, Fed Up Bird, Alex Cherry, Monty for Django, Lazy Eye, Kevin Meenan, Sylvanus Alzain for T Rogers, and Jack Rackham for John Seaford. So six of them in it then. Only one unlucky trainer who will get no prize money, and all in. And away they go then. A little bit slower to go was Lazy Eye, but the rest of them in pretty much an even line. Jack Rackham and Monty, the two yellow jacketed horses, are up in the lead. And it's Jack Rackham who looks like he's going to take them along. Then Jack Rackham from Monty, then Sylvanus Alzane after that one. The one in purple closest to us is Briquette. Lazy Eye and Fed Up Bird are the back two, but Jack Rackham is pulling the pace to this race. And they come down towards the final three furlongs. And Jack Rackham is already a good three lengths clear of Monty and Sylvanus Alzane. Then Briquette and Fed Up Bird, then Lazy Eye after that one. And that's the back marker, but it's Jack Rackham in front now, being impressed by Monty. Did Jack Rackham go off too quick? It looked like he might have done there into the final furlong and a half. Now then, Monty is now the one that shot clear. Jack Rackham trying to rally. Then Sylvanus Alzain, Lazy Eye and Philip Bird trying to get into it. Brick Etling caught flat footed, but it's Monty in the lead. Monty in the lead, the one on the outside. He looked like he was going to win a run. There was Alex Cherry's horse, Fed Up Bird, but it's Monty who's clear. Monty in the lead, and Monty looks like he might, I think, one put to bed. Won it really easily. And Monty takes it. Fed Up Bird, Lazy Eye, Sylvanus. Alzheimer Brickett and finally Jack Rackham and there you go I think that might well be Django sneaking a 0 to 80 if you can get him in get him in and that's the that's a win for Django Monty takes it then for Django Philip Bird for Alex Cherry second Lazy Eye Kevin Meenahan fourth Sylvanus Alzain for T Rogers was fourth and Briquette was fifth Jack Rackham along to was fifth that's John Seaford's I noticed him post posting in the forums yesterday stick at it they're all telling you to stick at it it will get better you will get a winner do what you've done there put your horse in the lowest race you can get in and it'll get better as weeks go on I'm glad you're having a good time and you will get a winner